Welcome, 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 welcome yes, one yes, and all yes. to another exciting edition it's of definitely. Saturday Live. Week after week, we bring you the best performances here in Ghana. And mm -hmm. this week is no exception because our lineup today is crazy. Nana Tufu. Fantastic lineup. I mean, exceptional artists, yes. man. They're holding their own in their own rights and they're doing amazing stuff yes. out there. Yes. So we thought, why not bring them in studio yes, to yes, treat yes, you guys yes, at yes, home yes, yes, to some yes. wonderful live band yes, music. Yes. Today's show is going to be fantastic. Mm -hmm. Just relax in your seat. But here... Yeah, when you feel the beat mm -hmm. up on your feet, yes. and let's rock to yes, it. Yes, this yes. is Saturday Live, and my name is Nana Tufo. And my name is Nana Ajwa Sako Diamin. So you can get interactive with us on all social media platforms. It's City TVGH. Or if you want to get personal with more, my Instagram is Nana Ajwa Sakodie. My Facebook is simply Nana Ajwa Sakodie Mensa. And my Twitter is Nana Ajwa Sak. Well, that's right. The WhatsApp number is 0550 Send in your messages and let's do this together as one yes. big happy family. Yes. What a way to start your weekend. But right here on Saturday Live, yeah. we're going to go for a quick spin. When we come back, <laughs> the party begins right here and oh. in your homes. Yes. There's a Saturday Live. Stay with us. Check, check, check any amount that you want, girl. Come on, he cash in. Wine for me, baby. Anything that you want for you, baby. And then you remember today, and today, day. We go free, do one, baby. Day, 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 day. When you wind up your CC, now come here. Eh. When you wind up your body, now come here. Eh. My yellow CC, when you wind up for me. My yellow CC. Yes, and I'm in town for dinner. My yellow CC, boy, my wine and for me. My yellow CC, yes, and I'm in town. Wine, mommy. Shake it, mommy. Sexy diva. She won't roll with the polar. Uh -huh. Boy, my wine, mommy. Shake it, mommy. Sexy diva. She won't roll with the polar. Shake your mommy, sexy diva. She won't roll, she won't roll with the bola. Oh, hear my wine, mommy. Shake your mommy, sexy diva. She won't roll with the bola. You can't ask one. But you can't, you can't say that you're more. I'm telling you guys a story. So I meet a girl, yellow CC. Shake your mommy, wine, mommy. So after yellow, see, 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 follow the storyline. Yeah, go. One next one. Shake your mommy. Sexy diva, sexy diva, sexy diva. Oh, yeah, whine, 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 mommy. Shake, shake your mommy. Sexy, sexy mommy. One. After 
my side may have me my toto, me yeah. Ah, my warrior. I'm a Simon Bash, I'm a Bash, I'm a warrior. I'm a sick, I'm a tia, 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 i Yo su su bone no tender fire, tender fire, eh. I throw. My worry, my worry, my worry, yo. My worry, yo. I'm on same moonsy, moonsy, ne ne. Worry, yo. Yeah. My worry, yo. I'm on same moonsy, moonsy, ne ne. Fantastic, I'm a tia, 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 I'm a Fantastic, I met you, I met you, and you know. It's a and a, what you know, so met you. Da na 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 na. She was the one. Some are worrying See, the boy knew when you smile, you do all. What's in my coma? What's in my coma? But who did you tell story now? Chash, chash. I was blessed the day I found you. God bless the day I found you. One of my dreams came true. He made my dreams come true. When I look in your eyes, that's when I realize how deep, deep I'm in love. How deep I'm in love with you, girl. You do all of it. Yeah, yeah, girl. You do all of it. Yeah, you do all. Oh, him man, you do all. Yeah, you do all of it. Make my head go, sing a ling a ling. Make my head go, as you did. Make my head go, only you, only you, yeah. yeah. Should they make my head go, sing a ling a ling. Make my head go, sing a ling a ling. Make my head go, sing a ling a ling. Only you, t t t. I, I saw brought your fans a be already. Say so, or don't see me when you say, Mamma, and Quana Seme Qua, or Domine one echo, free semi no do ya chitain, Sama, my eye, Mamma, folk, who people can shaman and say, Sawana me do, me him, Una Udikai, Upianum, Bomusia, Mofeni, do all. So 
Watch if I sabe how many say so. Or don't see me when you shake. Mami kona se me kwa. Or don't me ne wa ne. Fi se me nu do ya che time sa ma my eye. Mami fu ko upi pon. Can shama sign se una me do me ma una udi kai. Upi anu ngo musi a wa fani zuba. You dey make you dey make my head go. Make my head go. Sing a ling a ling. Only you make my head go. Sing a ling a ling. Only you make my head go. Sing a ling a ling. You dey make my head go. Sing a ling a ling. You dey make my head go. Sing a ling a ling. Only you make my head go. Sing a ling a ling. Only you make my head go. That was simply you. amazing, man. Thank you, thank you, thank awesome you. stuff, awesome stuff. Well, let, let's talk to you for a second, and then we can take some uh, messages as well. Um, we we, we want to find out um, if you can just move this way for me. Okay. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Tell us, when did you start your music? Uh, <coughs> music, music, professionally, or music as a general? Music in general. When did you start, and then when did you decide to go professional with it? Um, I, I grew up listening to music, like mm -hmm. from family, my mom. My mom dad, was, yeah, my mom and dad was in a choir, and uh, awesome. so um, I grew up listening to Kwejenchi. Yeah, man, the yeah, legend. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> the Dad Lumbes, yes, the um, other one, the um, uh, Bob Marley. So yeah, man. um, True. I, I was lucky enough to find music around me when I, I was growing up. And great, great. My dad, my dad did good for me. He took me to the music school as, as my early stage. Oh wow, so, that's great. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I I started early enough mm -hmm. to say to brag about it mm -hmm. but professionally i'll say the first single i did was way back in late um 209 2009 yeah and it was because my my uncle had the studio so I, oh, okay I, I i did not pay for it so mm -hmm. i had to just try my luck and it was good mm -hmm. so um i did my service i came back again in 2015 mm -hmm. Um, like professionally to take music as a career. So 2015 was when I dropped. But well, that's when yeah. you really took off. Yeah, yeah, took off. Your music. Think, yeah. Awesome. But then was it around the same time you met Samini? How did you meet Samini? Samini was, um, I met Samini around, I think the, the next year I started. So like 2016 um, or 2017 when Kenata did his confession video. That was when I met mm. Samini face to face. I've seen, I've spoke with him. Like I've seen Samini's work, yeah. but speaking with Samini was the first time I spoke with Samini was that time, like mm -hmm. confession video. So yeah. Kenata introduced me to Samini, Samini. That oh, this is a friend of mine, and mm -hmm. so, so and so and so so. So that that was the first. Okay, time so Kenata is or was a friend at the time, yeah, and then yeah, you yeah. on set shooting the confession, yeah, the video. confession video. Samini came through, and then the introduction yeah. happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's yeah. through Kenata you met Samini. Yeah, through Kenata I wow. met Samini. Wow, yeah. wow, but. So Samini invited you onto the VGMA stage. Yeah. First of all, tell yeah. us how did that feel? It was it was crazy. It mm -hmm. was crazy. Um, and I still have that. I I, I wish, I wish it, it was the moment was a picture I could keep mm -hmm. or post it in a room. But it's it's, it's a moment. So yeah. I mean, and it, it's, it's a great feeling to come from a um, legend like Samini for Samini to endorse you mm -hmm. and not on any stage like VGM stage yeah. like the biggest platform mm -hmm. in Ghana music um, Ghana music so mm -hmm. uh, it was it was a great experience and uh, it, it, it made me realize every step I make from that time should be a positive one because eyes yeah, eyes were on me and mm -hmm. I I couldn't mess up that chance yeah. that was that was it so it was a great experience for me was Samini Aside his mere musical dexterity, is known to have a talent or an eye for sporting talent. Yeah. The likes of Stone Boy, the likes of Kinata. On that stage, he endorsed you as the next big thing. Uh, Since then, do you feel any pressure to live up to that tag? <coughs> yeah, as, as human as I am, I, can, I can't deny that. Mm -hmm. And if I should deny that, should, I, I'm, I'm lying, obviously. So, um, 
all eyes coming on, mm -hmm. all eyes on me, because Samini, as a legend, has done it several times. Mm -hmm. um, and Dawson, Stoneboy, mm -hmm. and Dawson, Kenata, and they are doing very well in the yeah. industry. That's so true. the pressure from course and everything. And I think from that time, that year, mm -hmm. I, I decided to lay back for a while because every song I should release from then should come with that force. Yeah. And people, people were talking a lot. Like, okay, uh, is he up to the tax? Is mm -hmm. he so, so, and so? So it's even um, a question I asked myself. Okay, am I up to this task? Or whatever I'll bring, at, will it fit to the market? Or sure. will people appreciate? Is it something that some really want to regret? Mm -hmm. Or is it something people will listen and say, okay, so that's yeah. the guy some really and So yeah. it, has, it has been a question myself. Mm -hmm. But the, me having a pressure or something was... Yeah. was, was of, obvious yeah. as human I, I mean I agree I agree the endorsement was huge it was national everybody saw it obviously well we're sure he'll be guiding you through your oh, musical yeah, journey yeah. but we want to find out are you signed on to Samini's label no 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 you're not yeah I'm not I'm not uh, I'm not but I'm still part of the Hydra family <laughs> yeah I've always been part of the mm -hmm. Hydra family I knew Kenata way back in Takrade and, um, oh, are you a tardy boy? No, no, that that was the place I went. Um, um, I, I did my schooling. So, oh, okay, great. That was Which when school? I met Takrade Technical University. Great, great, yeah. great. So, um, high grade has always been a family. Mm. Samini's so, personal manager, David Kada, is a friend of mine in Kumasi. I know him from Kumasi. Um, and I was with beat. you. Oh, yeah. I was born in Kumasi. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, I schooled in. Takrade, yeah, and did my service and everything in Accra. So, wow, I, I have the opportunity to mm. visit all this tri the triangle yeah. regions, and I know the people, the, the people, influential mm -hmm. people in this city. So, I mean, I'm, I'm lucky enough to Great. to be Great. in this position. But are you hoping to be signed on to high grade? Yeah, yeah. If it, if it happens, mm -hmm. why not? And and high grade has, has done a lot of work for themselves. Like mm -hmm. they have good credit. So, yeah. 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 Right, let's find out. How many songs do you have in total? In total, mm -hmm. like from the time I started, mm -hmm. I, like have, I have professionally. A, professionally, I mm -hmm. have more than I have more than twenty songs. I have mm -hmm. more than fifty songs. So and what's I have the, the wait for? A promotion. <laughs> I have a studio in the house. I oh, do. Okay. I literally do. You keep cooking. Yeah, I literally do songs every day. But mm -hmm. you know, it's 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 um, promo promotion mm -hmm. is always the problem, and it's always better mm -hmm. to get impact from whatever you put out there than mm -hmm. just drop songs you understand so i have this ep coming legendary journey yeah yeah um full That's high, life. high life yeah, yeah full, full high life um ep how many songs on it six songs on six. it. six like five and one bonus one song. bonus and awesome the main idea behind legendary journey is i want to be like the Saminis, be like mm -hmm. Yeah. so that's the journey i'm taking and the influence um the inspiration came from um mm. Samini and Kwejenchi. So what I do is, the volume one, I do High Life. Mm -hmm. um, volume and um, the next one, I do Reggae. Wow. That's, that's uh, wow. Samini. And the, probably the third one, I do Dion Boache. Like, I present Dion Boache to the people. So okay. the first one is High Life, mm -hmm. representing Kwejenchi. And the next one will be Reggae Dance mm -hmm. Hall, representing Samini. And the third one will be Dion Boache. Wow. Yeah. So you're taking us on a musical journey yeah. from Kudwentri's time, yeah. then we move into Samini's time, and, and then you step yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. That's the best, best of both worlds. But I notice that in your songs, you're telling a story. Yeah. So you're, you're, you're coming from uh, a journey with a lady, then yeah. you get married, and then you do all. Yeah. So how, how do you do it? When you're writing one song, are you thinking of the next one? You know, it happens. It happens. Sometimes you, you don't plan these things, but mm -hmm. it just happens. So um, you do song and you try to image them, um, try to make it make sense to yeah. the listener. So I have um, marriage songs, I have mm -hmm. love songs, like the beginning of relationship, the yeah. process. I have breakup songs. So I mean, and these are experiences people have had. True. So uh -huh. So you find your first love, mm -hmm. you marry that first love, and probably it's a risk a risk yeah. like you you getting divorced or you getting breakup is something mm. you should think about so 
that's the the journey as well. Mm. So currently, you are not signed onto any record no, 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 no. but you're looking for a label. Yeah. Now let's talk about the, the the this issue out there that when big names or big artists who have labels sign on new acts, and then after a while they push them into the limelight, they get up there, and then there's that confusion about loyalty and all that. You are a new act coming up, more or less. I mean, you've, you've held your own. We've yeah. heard about you. Your songs are doing amazing out there, but you are without a label. Mm. What is your take on this issue? Uh, this, you know, it has always been a problem. Now, upcoming ones are facing this problem because the people are ahead, the relationship between the investors and the label and the artists mm. wasn't um, good. We have various examples to, to, mm. to name it. Yeah. And um, I think it's high, high time people should respect paper mm -hmm. like in, yeah. in Ghana. Because if everything is on paper, I'm not sure people can go against yeah. the paperwork. So if you sign an artist and the rules and everything in the paper, like stated in the paper, should happen you. And it's not happening. You, you just mm -hmm. go to the court and make things move the way it's supposed to be but that's true Ghanaians or Africans don't take these things serious mm. so uh, it's something we should we should just uh, pay attention to yeah. true I agree I have a couple messages here for you I'm just going to run through them real quick this one says I'm watching the show live from Ivory Coast Dion Boache you are superb and you have a great voice this one says hashtag Saturday live my name is Chris Della I'm watching the show live all the way in Tamale I'm loving it. Wow. Hashtag big ups, Dion Boache. This one says big ups to City TV. My name is AB. I'm watching City TV that. live from Choco. I love this channel and I can't go anywhere on Saturday because of Saturday Live. This one says Dion, you do all. I thought it was you, you know, because of his yeah, face and yeah. stuff. All the best. This one says I'm Trigger from Akimoda. My man, Dion Boache. Eh? Man, you make big man. Shout outs to Don Simon and Tribal. This one says, I'm Mrs. Davidson, and I wish my husband and children in Asin North all the best in life. I wish them, or I love them very much. Yeah, Dion, let me ask you about that. Do you get that a lot, that comparison between you and Kwame Eugene? Um, after, after I, I trimmed my dress off, mm -hmm. that's, that's when I got yeah. these comments. But before I had the, the, locks. the locks, nobody was comparing mm. me to Eugene. But he's my, lit, he, my, he's my little brother, so I mean. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. But then you, you trimmed off and then you left one hanging somewhere. Yeah, yeah but <laughs> why I, is that? <laughs> I had to let that one to go. Really? That, was, that was the champion at Tawat. Yeah, 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 but what you found that decision? Were you pressurized to take it off? Not really, but you know, as 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 a person, you reach a certain stage, mm -hmm. you just need to let some people, some some things go. Yeah, and not for any particular reasons, but it's it's just a stage. And now I have a lot of people doing dread, so I just had to be yeah. odd and do my thing as well. Yeah, yeah. you need to stand out. You need to yeah. be unique in your yeah. own way. Well, talk about uniqueness. We're going to enjoy more of your songs because your style is unique. This is Saturday Live. Dion has two more songs to go, and then we can wrap up with him. Then, of course, we have some man eh from Osrani to Akan. Just wait for it. But in time, between time, it's Dion Boache. This right here is Saturday Live. Send your messages through WhatsApp. The number is 0550-585832. If you're watching us on DSTV and you're outside of Ghana, use the code PLUS233. You can also hit us up on Facebook and on Twitter. All handles. It's at CTTV. GH. All right, Dion. And of course, the Dicro International Band is in the building. Let's rock this party like nobody. Okay, so we still... We still on the story. You do after you do on Muntia the Akira Fiye, man. Yeah, to the end. Obi be a misan in your Akira. Akira. Obi in so mi mo na man kumi wo. Eje ima. So people here me sad and you are breathy I call them skin pains and now see what me get It's pains in my heart Was the only one I trusted betrayed me When you be a say my damn for quad Why me does in movies and studies Yeah Oh be so me more oh Now I walk more I dare so many Make up 
Come on, someone in it. Oh, baby, I'm a sad and you are breathy. Oh, we are. Oh, being so me more than I'm coming more. Hey, Jay, my home. Sad and you are breathy, oh, we are. Being so me moan, I'm a coming one. A jay, my command. You can't, you know, man, Jendi. So be by me, sad and you are breathy. I call them skin pains, and I'll see what I get. It's pains in my heart. Was the only one I trusted betrayed me. When you're of your son, Madame Bokwan. I saw that in movies and thought fishes can never happen in realities. Oh, be so me more. In a rap, what more? I can't so many. They could come as someone in it. Oh, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember, you're still tuned in to Saturday Live, your number one musical entertainment show to hit That's right. your TV screen just gone by. What's the amazing... Dion, Dion Wachi, who actually rocked. Super talented. The, yes, guy. very, I mean, very good. Amazing voice. Mm, very good voice. Yo, I was dancing backstage. I had to get my groove on. You know what I'm saying? I yes. Mean, he, he could always kick a party. He, he could, could, he could, he could, he could, he could. Super, super, super stuff. I yes. Mean. But Dion the party. Wachi, Charlie, big ups to you, man. Keeps on getting better. Yep, better and, and better. better. And better. <laughs> One of my favorite other artists is in the building. Mm -hmm. I used to love him when he was in Rough and Smooth. Yep. I used to dance to his songs all the time, but yep. today be today. He is actually in the Saturday Live studio. I can will rock you. That's for right. The the second act for today, mm -hmm. and after we have the beautiful Adina, who actually sprinkle a bit of beauty on our set. Yes, sir. So if you're ready, we're ready. Yes. We're bringing up on stage the man they call Akan. He has come yes. on a long journey yes. from the days of being solo yes. or shrani, then yes. moving into a group with yes. Bullet, yes. rough and smooth. Yes. Now he's back as a solo artist, and today. He's going to bless the mic. Remember, this is Saturday Live. Yes. Send your messages coming in. 0550-585832. If you're ready, we I'm, are ready. Yes, I'm definitely ready. All right. <laughs> Akan Music. Let's do this. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Akan. Are you guys ready? You know my name, I can't know. Yeah. See, 
if you really want to know listen to this you take my body out and so girl i don't want it to go every time i drunk with it i walk my come and move oh day no be lie yo can't deny yo i fall in love i go do you well treat you well protect my girl no be lie yo call the video call ricardo may they follow me to see your mama Okay, listen. Girl, you be my lover. Girl, I go do everything for you, my baby. Oh, if you say my true would be a one, my come away. So I say, say, don't be lie, yo, don't be lie, yo, don't be lie, yo. You ready now? No, don't be lie, yo, don't be lie. I say, don't be lie, yo, don't be lie, yo. So the next song is title I'm in a Yeah 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 Whoa 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 Girl you just enter my brain no That be the reason they say I live my do Oh oh yeah 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 Come in yeah 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 I'm a seer too Men come and join him in the world so no, I say, make you tell me what your problem. I no go waste no time to solve them. Now so we go live our life together. We do not want no get no wahala. I no go give you no palaver. Now so we go live our life forever. So everybody say, say, I'm in a. Give me something, give me something, make I feel you. Body grow, body grow. You ready now? Let's listen. Yes. 
It's a brand new song. You guys haven't heard or seen it anywhere before. It's a brand new song, and I'm just performing for you guys. You ready? Come. Are you ready? Are, are you ready? Everybody, are you ready? Yeah. You ready? Let's go. Sing. Come. Listen. Somebody somewhere don't want to see you. Oh, you blow to me, Chris. Massive turn. I tell you, man, man, it's been raining drums and chords and vocals. Super amazing stuff. I can't. Bad Yo, energy. Martin, Martin, away, Martin, you know. Martin, Martin. <laughs> Can you come this way for me so okay. we can have a little chat? And then before we get into the chat, me, I'd like to take you back. Back into the days of uh, Srani. When you were uh, Srani. Now, you had a song with um, Screwface. Yeah. You remember that one? If you see your wife, your mother. Yeah, man. Say what I carry them go. 
Who are you go savvy? Who are you go let make it out? Niceness, niceness. Yeah. That song was bad, man. I really, really love. You know, that I used song. to be a rapper back then, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 You still remember your lines? <laughs> <laughs> You're talking about like 15 years ago, man. I know, right? Yeah. I know, right? The mean house way back. Yeah, the rap mean house. Yeah, the house. But it's all good. Yeah. It's all good. I mean, you start as a solo artist, Oshadi. Yeah. Then you move into the group of Bullets. Yeah. Rough and smooth. Now you're back as a solo artist. Yeah. Which one you think worked better for you, solo or in the group? Well, uh, what I can say is that, you know, with the solo project, like, the major solo project that I'm doing, I've just started. So I believe uh, being a solo project now mm-hmm. is going to take me places. You know, It's going to continue what we were planning to do with mm-hmm. Rough and Smooth. You know, with Rough and Smooth, we had, a, we had a, a mission to accomplish, and we couldn't accomplish it. So we are about to take it to the next level where I can. Yeah. Right. But it, let's talk about the group Rough and Smooth. How did you meet Bullet, and how did you guys come up with the name Rough and Smooth? How did you put that group together? Well, I met Bullet around 2006. Mm-hmm. He came to me and was like, yeah. We did a song together. He mm-hmm. came to me and it was like, he wanted us to, you know, come together and form mm-hmm. a group. So I had to think about it. I thought about it and I was like, let me give it a shot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We came together. We started changing the style of music we were doing then. Then everything started, you know, clicking. Mm-hmm. Then, yeah. You, you guys were hot back yeah, in the day. Rough and yeah, rough and smooth. And smooth. Yeah. You were hot. So you were, you were rough? No, you are how, smooth. How can I be rough? <laughs> but, whilst I'm smooth. So you're we, the lover man, huh? <laughs> no, but like, like we didn't have, you know, like initially rough and smooth was about life. Mm-hmm. Life is always rough yeah, and smooth. Yeah, so, but people, that, yeah. you know, decided to attribute it to our yeah, styles and yeah. individuals and mm-hmm. everything. Yeah. So. But you're quoted to have said that uh, the group collapsed because Bullet decided to go into artist management. Were you disappointed with that, this decision? Well, uh, from the beginning, because, you know, if you are working with someone and mm-hmm. you want to do or do something different from what you are doing, you yeah. need to sit down the crew and let them know what you, you want to do. Mm-hmm. But that wasn't the case with Ralph and Smooth from the beginning, mm-hmm. with Bullet going into management. So in the beginning, I was kind of, yeah, but later I just, I was like, man, Bullet has always been wanting to do that. So let him, you know... Mm-hmm try his best and he, he was able to become successful with that so i was happy for him as of that time yeah yeah you guys are cool yeah we're cool mm-hmm. we're cool but he said that you come to ghana and you don't look for him <laughs> <laughs> you know when when we were working together mm-hmm. yeah i think it was because of the work that we were you know kind of seeing each other all the time okay. but now everybody's different like everybody's doing their solo thing so mm-hmm. it's kind of you know Timing and everything is kind of when you when you want to bring all those into into it is kind mm-hmm. of yeah different. So I don't think it's gonna be like how we used to work together as group. Okay, yeah. let me play the devil's advocate and infer from what you're saying. Yeah. You're saying you were work colleagues, but you're not friends. Say that again. Your work colleagues. We were. You were work colleagues, but you're not friends. I think we were friends back there. Mm-hmm. Back then, work colleagues. But now, because everybody is kind of, you know, doing their own thing, so, mm-hmm. like, that, that friendship thing is not in existence like it used to be. Mm-hmm. And the work to rough and smooth work is not in existence now. Now it's about our can. Mm-hmm. Bullet is also doing his management thing, so, yeah. yeah. Now he's into management, and yeah. he's doing fine yeah. by all standards. Yeah. You have gone solo as an artist. Yeah. What will be your initial reaction if Bullet should hit you up and ask to manage you? Manage me? Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, for me, um, the kind of the vision I have is, 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 is very big. So if, you know, any management want to mm-hmm. engage in my activity or yeah. everything, they, they have to have the vision that I have. Because I, I believe I'm from Ghana, but I need mm-hmm. to make music that every year on this earth mm-hmm. can relate and listen to. So mm-hmm. it's not almost like it's not particular particularly about only Ghana, you get what I mean? I'm trying to do music mm-hmm. that can take over the world. So yeah. if I see people, if I see management with the same kind of vision, mm-hmm. why not? Yeah. I can't, you, you, you wrote music for Ebony? Uh, uh, Meduja was rough mm-hmm. and smooth song. We okay. gave it to Ebony. And from the beginning, I was kind of directing her. Anytime they, they go to studio and, and yeah. I'm in Ghana, 
Bulay will come and pick me, or he come, and, he call me and tell me to, you know, go and assist, mm. because he knows that, like in the group, I was the singer, I was the lead vocalist, so mm -hmm. he always come and take me. We go mm. to the studio and go help things out. Yeah. What of Danaya? Yeah, I wrote. Uh, I've been writing a lot, you know. Mm -hmm. I've been like behind the scenes. I've been writing a lot, so I wrote that song for Danaya. Mm. Initially, I wrote it for Bull uh, for Ebony. Yeah, but. Uh, uh, I gave it to Nanaya when Bullets uh, has started doing a lot of interviews about you know the breakups and things. So mm -hmm. I gave it to Nanaya. Okay. And uh, apart from that, I have been writing for a couple of artists outside Ghana mm -hmm. and then in Ghana yeah. as well. Yeah. So it's a side thing that I do as a, as I do, mm. as I performing and you know. In music. Right. You mentioned Bullets doing interviews. Now, you, you know, this industry remains vibrant. It thrives on the rumors. Yeah. You have observed on a radio station that anytime you want to drop a song, Bullets goes on yeah, to that's what I've uh, seen. A, a sister station to drop some comments that seem to shut down whatever you're trying to project. Is this something you have sat back, observed, calculated, and you think it's a deliberate attempt to dim your light? And have you spoken to Bullets about this? No, I haven't spoken to him, but I, it all started when, when I, I wanted to release the, my first single, Amina. Mm -hmm. So I called him and I sent him the song. He listened to it. It was like, wow, this is a beautiful song. If mm. you are able to get a video, it's going to go, and you push it, it's going to go in Ghana. Mm. So I was very happy that you know, my brother could advise me on that level. On that level, yeah. So like, I think the next day, he granted an interview, and he, like, he was trying to paint me, paint a picture, and put me there as the... Mm -hmm. as the one who collapsed the group. So I was like, I just talked to you, you know. I know that now you are doing your solo project. Yeah. You're doing, we were doing rough and smooth. You decided to go into full-time management, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Which you didn't really sat the whole crew down. And, yeah. Yeah. So I was like, man, I know that it's something you've been wanting to do, mm -hmm. so let me just support you. That's why I supported him. So I thought he was going to support when I, I started releasing my solo singles. Mm -hmm. But, you know, any time I try to release a song, Maybe Bullet will grant an interview and, you know, be saying things that would demean, you know, my character or maybe. Because yeah. I, haven't, I haven't really, like, I haven't gone to any interview mm -hmm. and say anything bad about Bullet, Bullet. or anything pertaining to mm. the group collapsing. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, like, I didn't push any blame to anyone. Yeah. I said that, you know, rough and smooth, as, 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 as at the point we are now, everybody is doing... Yeah, individual so stuff, you get what yeah. I mean. So sometimes we come back together and, mm. and release his songs for you guys. So we just, yeah. you know, check what we're doing. But mm. Bullet has been saying things that got me. So I, I felt like, uh, why anytime I'm trying to release or something, then an interview, interview will be granted and, mm. you know, things will be said. So, but yeah. uh, it's all cool. It's all part of life, you know. But are you pained by this? Sorry? Are you hurt by this? Yeah. You think it, Bullet is out to get you? No, I, th I, don't, I don't know the, the reason behind it, mm. but I, 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 felt, I felt disappointed mm. because I thought, you know, we were brothers and we were working together. Yeah. And even though we are doing individual things, but we are brothers, we're right. still brothers. If Bullet becomes successful, it still affects me. If I become successful, it affects Bullet. Mm. You know, last time I was like, okay, so if Bullet is promoting an artist and artist, the artist become big, and maybe at that time, in my life, maybe nothing is really going mm -hmm. on for me, and maybe I need something from Bullet. Yeah. I could call him. He could call me in the same thing, like vice versa. Yeah. So why would you... You get what I mean? Okay. Why don't you support each other and mm -hmm. you know, push our individual project that we're doing? Right. Not to defend Bullet, but we know the industry thrives on hype. Yeah. Have you thought about it this way? He goes into the interviews, throws in that kind of stuff mm -hmm. to put you out there. So when you drop a song, it blows, it picks off. I don't think so. <laughs> you don't think so? No, I don't. Why not? I don't think so. I don't think Why so. Why not? I, I don't think so because I, for me, I don't think so. I mm -hmm. don't think that, you know, you deliberately, like, go to, go to an interview and, you know, say that. It's all part of the hype. Yeah, but if, if it's hype, we have to sit down and plan it. <laughs> you get what I mean? But it's not hype. Well, he's trying, maybe, 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 just maybe he's trying to support you from behind the scenes. Maybe unconsciously he thought maybe... Mm -hmm. he, you know, yeah, because the last interview I saw, like, I wasn't happy about it. Right. Yeah. So did you confront him? No, I didn't confront him. Why not? Yeah, because I... I, 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 I no, I thought that, <laughs> I thought that like, 
you know, I've been, I've been sending him my songs, mm -hmm. and he will, yeah. he will talk nice and talk good things about it, but yeah. maybe he will go on an interview and say the otherwise. So mm. I was like, man, just, let me just stay back and, yeah. you know, do my thing. Yeah. All right, enough about that. Let's talk about you. Now you're back, you're running solo. How many songs have you produced now? I, I think uh, it's about four, five. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm in uh, Obama dance. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then uh, Yawa. Mm -hmm. Then the new song that I'm dropping, Bad, Bad Energy. Energy yeah. Let's talk about Bad Energy. Bad well, Energy. What's, what informed the song, the title, and even the lyrics in there? What informed it? Well, I believe that everybody on this earth has haters. Mm -hmm. And they are haters also to, like, they, they are haters to have haters. Mm -hmm. So it's a song that I decided to write for everybody. Because mm -hmm. I think you can put yourself in the song. Are you sure you're right? you wrote that song for everybody? I wrote, wrote it for, for Bullets. When I'm writing song, I don't write it for particular. Rumor has it that you did the song because of Bullets. No, I didn't do it because, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do it because of Bullets. You're you know, sure? when I'm writing song, mm -hmm. I don't think about one person or I don't think about a group of people. I think about, I, I think about people like the, yeah. what happens in our society. Mm -hmm. I, can, I can put myself in there. Yeah. You get what I mean? You can put yourself because you have exactly. haters. I have haters. You get what I mean? That's true. But I didn't direct the song to a particular person. Yeah, I think maybe it's because of the comments that he, he's been making, mm -hmm. and people are, you know, mm -hmm. Ghanaians they will add things up and uh, they will just, mm -hmm. you know, say something. But I didn't make it for anyone. All right, I, I'm ready for you. <laughs> well, I love it. I love it. I mean, yeah, I, mean I, I don't think I need any bad energy around me at this time. Of course. Yeah. So I think I love that song. It's a great song. Yeah. And I tell you, uh, it's gonna blow. How spiritual bad are you? Energy, stay far away. Yeah, man. Far How spiritual away. are you? How spiritual are you? How in spiritual percentage? are you? Yeah, because I hear you've been going to church to pray over your song yeah, to make it blue you know, and all that. Like, let me tell you a secret. Before we came out mm -hmm. with Swaga, yeah, yeah, Swaga, we had to pray a lot. You know, we were going to church like I think four times a week, mm -hmm. and I believe that if as as humans, if you have a breakthrough on this earth, it has to it has to be spiritual. Mm -hmm. And when it comes to spiritual, mm -hmm. you, of course, you cannot go and leave the person who made you, that is God, mm -hmm. and go, you get what I mean? So I believe in God and I believe in whatever I have to do to God for God to open the way for me. Yeah. All right. I can't thank you very much thank for very passing much, through. Great stuff. Great stuff. Amazing stuff. Thank you, my so, Yes. The new single is out. Bad Energy. Go check it out. I can is doing amazing stuff. I've got a couple messages here. I'm going to run through them real quick. This one says, good afternoon. I'm Sami from Kumasi. I just so I'm enjoying the songs this afternoon with my lovely girlfriend. May God bless Bye, Saturday time. Live. This one says, I've seen only you, Frida. I have admired only you, Frida. And I desire only you, Frida. Hey, Charlie. The first day pass. <laughs> Charlie, cool down. Hey. This one's from Samuel Twaman, sir. Saturday Live, I can't afford to miss the Odikro band. Is the best. Please tell the lead guitarist that the film was Kishpar from East Legon. And he says he loves City TV. This one says, I can't, you are superb. But that Amina... I hope it's not my Amina. This one says, hello, good afternoon now. His, he sings really good. I really love his song, Pa. Nice one. God bless you. Salama too from Kade. And she says, I really love City TV. And there's a last one here that says, Saturday Live, I can't afford to miss. Odiko Band be the best. Yes, well, that's true. Odiko International Band, of course, is the best. And you get to enjoy them every other Saturday right here on City TV. We're going to go for a quick break. When we come back, we're going to treat you to that silky voice, that songstress that brings the magic to the microphone. I'm talking about Adina. She's is in the studio. And when we come back from the break, we get to enjoy her. Stay with us. Don't go nowhere.
want you to fix yourself and learn how to love yourself and then love me. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? Am I preaching to this afternoon? Am I preaching? And so, I'm here to tell you that, baby, your money doesn't impress me. What's that say? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Baby, I'll finish out. Let's go. Baby, I'll finish out. 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 Baby, I'll Feel like my love, oh yeah, love, oh 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 oh. Ooh, ah, things that you feel like my love, oh love, oh oh oh. I don't want your money, I just want your love, ain't no. I want it, I want it. If you show me something better, I don't want your money, I just want your love, ain't no. Show me something deeper. What are you dancing? What are you dancing with ya? Show me something. Show me something better. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just want your love. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want, I want. You must show me something better. I don't want your money. I just want your love. I want, I want. You must show me something better. I just want your love. I want, I want. You must show me something better. Awesome stuff. Big shout out to the Deco International Band, man. You guys always kill it. Adina, you yes. look ravishing. Thank you so much. You nailed that outfit. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Woo! Wait, let me catch my breath. Catch it, catch now, it. Now let me take a good look at you. Now I need to catch my breath. <laughs> hey, Ma. Oh, you rock that. Thanks. This is so pretty. Thank you so yeah, much. Yeah, but then let's start from the Sika Moots. Who are you sure you are doing this in Sika? Now, Hey! Who are you and no one you hear. No, I was working. <laughs> yeah, so um let's talk about last year. You were busy out there in the Pacific regions. Yeah. Playing shows from what how many uh, islands did you talk? Um well Australia is like an island. The different mm -hmm. cities in there are different. So we went to five mm -hmm. cities. No, three cities, two countries. Wow, wow. So what, what so was what was the experience like? 
Um, it was beautiful mm -hmm. to know that our song or the music that we do in Ghana yeah. has been able to travel so far. Mm -hmm. um, that was just surreal mm. <laughs> to see the people sing it word for word. People who aren't even black. Yeah, you know, it was it was amazing. Yeah. So, how did you know that you could go out there, or you, had, you even had a fan base out there in the Pacific? They region? reached out to us. Whoa, that's huge. <laughs> they reached that's out to huge. us when um, we put out "Killing Me Softly," mm -hmm. and they kept saying, "You know, we love you so much from Fiji. We love you so much from Samoa. Right. We love you so much from here, New Zealand, blah blah blah." And some of the promoters mm -hmm. also decided to hit us up to say would you guys fancy coming to do a show mm -hmm. out here and so it sounded interesting to the team so wow my team and their team got together mm -hmm. and what the tour became was the results of awesome, that awesome awesome <laughs> awesome my phone is buzzing let me take oh, wow. a couple messages this one says hey i did feel her wow i always wish to have a song with her but i'm not connected the name is a wow and he says city tv keep it up I am going to take care of you at Dina, bad tune with Stoneboy. Big ups from Kingsley, I'm watching. This one says, Adina, Adina, Adina. How many times did I call you? Stop coming into my dreams. Hey. <laughs> you have been my crush since I started hearing of you. So please free me, okay? Please I really you love freak. your songs from DJ Assem. Thank you. Hold on, is this the DJ Assem we know? Hey. It's a DJ okay. too. <laughs> this one says, hi, I'm Kweku Fama from Kaswa. I'm really enjoying the show and in love with Adina's voice. Thank this you. one says, I am Sefe Chi, enjoying your program inside Kumasi in the Ashanti region. You are making my Saturday less stressful. Oh. Tell Adina I love her voice. Thank you. This one says, Adina, you look very sweet. You nailed it. And uh, what, four high fives in there for you. Wow. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> okay, hello City TV. This is Miki from Racecourse Takrade. Splendid performance from Adina. I could see she's somehow enjoying herself on the show. I am. Much love. <laughs> this one is Dina Faithfuls. Hey, oh. yeah. Oh, okay. Somebody posted that, so apparently that's what my fan, my fan, well, base, fan base is called. Well, that's what they said. Okay. It's, it's not bad. Dina Faithfuls. Hmm. There's a hashtag to it. It says Very Dina long, Faithfuls. Hey, so Charlie. With your premium pop up. I am. School fun. Hmm. Dina Faithfuls. All right. Adina, baby. Hi. I really love your music. In fact, you you're so too much. Love you, okay? Please play me Makuma. Okay, she's done that. I've God bless done you. That. It's from Salama Tufo and Kade. This one says Adina. Fire, fire, fire. Mr. For Good Singers Day, pal. Hey, Adina. Dina is really talented. Big ups to her. Thank I am so Odis from Kumasi. Hmm. Everyone is loving your voice. I love your voice. Yes. I think you're one of the best female vocal artists we have in the country. Thank now, you. what I want to find out is, do you have some special training you do? Well, yeah. I mean, I, I try to do vocal, vocal mm -hmm. train, warm-ups and lessons. I follow the lessons. And right. Stuff. The usual stuff that singers do. Mm -hmm. You know, that's what I do. Yeah. You sure it's the usual? Because the I, usual I mean, <laughs> when, you, when, you, when you sing, okay. Thank you. I, I'm trying Thanks. to control myself. Thanks. I mean, oh. I'm being emotional right now. I love you so much. What so. was that? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> but let's go back to the Pacific regions. You went there and you performed. I'm sure mm -hmm. there must be some artists there who are also on the bill as well. Yes, yes. Did you come back with any collaborations? Um, yes, one of the artists wanted to do a collaboration, mm -hmm. so we came back and we worked on it. It's for his album, mm -hmm. and so we sent it back, and they're working on it. But there are so many more that are asking for collaborations. So wow, wow, wow. Amazing stuff. It. I know you put a lot into your work. A yeah. whole lot goes into your music. Yeah. Which of your songs will you say was the most challenging when you were recording in studio? Um, Sika. Because it's very high. <laughs> I don't know if you guys noticed. Mm -hmm. Even when fans are singing it, yeah. they're like, oh, I don't want. Because, yes, I really, really went high mm -hmm. with that song. Yeah, it would probably be the most challenging to yeah. record. It used to be Makoma, but my voice range got used to it. Mm -hmm. As in, I kept performing yeah. it, and so I got so used you to adapted, it. So you yeah. It was cool. But Sika, yeah, yeah. It's not a joke. Oh. You went high. <laughs> yeah, it was high. <laughs> we'll talk about Sika. What inspired that song? Because um, it's deep, oh. It is. Even though we are, we are blatantly saying that I don't want your money, I just want your love, and a mm -hmm. lot of people are saying, we are sure say, although you're the The deeper message is that money is good. Mm -hmm. it's, it's important to have it. Obviously, but when yeah. all you have is money and you don't have any love, you're mm -hmm. pretty empty in life. It's, it could be a really sad condition for mm -hmm. you, you know. So that's really what I'm preaching. You need love. Money is important to attain, but love is the ultimate. Mm -hmm. You need to get it.
You can't yeah. just be made doing vows day, vows day. Yes, they can give you all the gifts. They can give you whatever it is. But if they're beating you up, mm -hmm. then that's sad. You yeah. know? So if you are getting the money, make sure that there's real love attached mm. to it. Yeah. You know? Find true love. That's really it. Awesome, awesome. But that song, I don't know. I, I, I'm Kudrenchi biased. Forgive oh, me. Nice. So I think in my ear, I hear yeah. a bit of Kudrenchi in there. Really? This is the first time I've heard that. But let me see if I hear it. <laughs> I don't want your money. In the beat or what? I don't your love you. Maybe there. I maybe there. <laughs> Maybe there. <laughs> okay, so it wasn't intentional. <laughs> no, I've it never even thought about. Mm -hmm. You should probably yeah. ask Kitty this because he wrote. It. Oh, Kitty wrote that song. Yeah. <laughs> Kitty, solid guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Solid yeah. guy, amazing Bad. guy. Yeah. So tell us, what, what is that one thing you are hoping to achieve in the music industry that you have not yet achieved? Hmm. I feel like I need to make more impact. Mm -hmm. There's no expiry date to make an mm -hmm. impact. If I've been able to make impact with five songs, I want to do more mm. to like the very ends of it like yeah. you know what i mean because at the end of the day i want to be able to speak to people when i yeah. and i want them to hear it i hope they heard the sika because mm -hmm. i know everybody's fighting sika like mm -hmm. mm, me they want the money yeah. so i hope people you know mm -hmm. yeah get the message at the end yeah. of the day because that's the, that's the whole point yeah but how well are you doing with streaming and the, how, how well do you think it has caught along with our people the fact that you pull out a song mm -hmm. and before you know it some sites or some bloggers are throwing it yeah. out there yeah. i mean that is to your cost yeah but then how well are you doing with streaming and what is that message you like to give your fans to get them to go online stream them and not pirate them I know it's easier because there's not a lot of people that use smartphones mm. that can have Apple Music and all these or fancy apps. The exactly. Yeah. So they'll just do what they know best, mm -hmm. Google, find the first link. Mm -hmm. And I know they're doing it because the consumers are doing it because they're fans and yeah. they want to get their hands on the music. Mm. So you can't fault them too much. Yeah. And I pray that God blesses them enough <laughs> to get <laughs> devices that would allow them to do the right thing. Right. You know, that's really all I can say. But I still appreciate the love, mm. even though it's pirating. It's love in a way. <laughs> mm. I know, right? So I appreciate it. Yeah. 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 Now, most of the artists have their own concerts. Uh, yeah. There's the BIM, there's the Rappaholic, yeah. um, a number of them. Are we going to be treated to an Adina concert? Definitely, yes, but I don't know if I'll be do making it a, recur a recurring concert mm -hmm. that's like every year. I don't know, mm. but I will be giving, maybe my, my time frame wouldn't be yearly, Yeah. but I will, yeah. I will. We're, we're starting from this year? This year, yes. Mm. Yes, actually, yeah. Well, I'm asking, <laughs> yes, 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 we're, we're, we're working on year. some things, but right. it has to be solid before I can talk about it, yeah, right. but definitely before the middle of this year or by mm. the middle of this year, there will be something like that. Right. Who's yeah. that one artist you'd give everything to have a collaboration with? Give everything. Mm -hmm. Like, who's that one artist you really want to do a collab with? Can't I just share it? Because <laughs> uh, there are a lot of people. Yeah, can't I share? Like, share the everything mm -hmm. I have amongst the artists that, you know? Them. Yeah, I so. get that. But, like, who's that one artist that you really want to do a collaboration with? Hmm. That you haven't done with yet? Yet. Mm -hmm. There's so many people. I have, mm -hmm. <laughs> I have so many people that I'd love to do songs with. Mm -hmm. There's so many talented people. Yeah. I can't even name names. Um, anybody that's amazing that has inspired my music in mm -hmm. Ghana, all the greats yeah. from back in the day. Even now, I have yeah. people that inspire me. I've done songs with some of them. Mm -hmm. um, so many. I can't mention a name. Right. But just know that if you're doing amazing, you never know. My team might just be calling you. Mm -hmm. What's up? <laughs> How about a collaboration? <laughs> okay, nice, nice. Let's talk about relevance in the industry yeah. and uh, especially with respect to the females. Now the mm -hmm. industry is quite saturated with a number of female acts. Yeah, amazing. And it's great. Amazing. It's great. I amazing. mean, we were waiting for this and it's here. It's we hope it grows. But yeah. the competition now is more keen. Mm. So how do you stay relevant in these times? I mean, I'll just stick to what I am doing mm -hmm. because I feel like I'm very unique in the industry. What I have to offer is uniquely Adina. Right. And I feel like all the other artists that are coming up also, if they haven't worked on it yet, are still working on, you know, carving that niche for them. Great. And if I'm doing my thing and everyone else is doing their thing, there mm -hmm. really isn't any competition. We're all just making the industry better. So, right. Yeah. Let's take a couple more messages. This one, Kwame Sedem Joey is watching from Georgia, USA, and he's hey. really liking Adina's performance. This one says, nice one there, Adina. My name is Kweku Siang. This one is um, Bless, Ata a champong. Wow, amazing voice, Adina, really love it. This Thank one you. says, Charlie, tell the bassist I'm in love with him. Okay, Bruce Lee. Okay, okay. 
<laughs> Charlie. Someone is asking if Patapa will come to the show. We'll speak to their team and see. Yeah, mm -hmm. hopefully we'll bring him here. Yeah, this one says, I am Nana Kwame Arthur from Kumasi. Adina, you're super talented. Thank so, you. So, yes, the people are really loving you. Thank you. They're feeling the vibes. And, of course, you know, it's only on Saturday Live that you get to experience it live. Yeah. Yeah? And of course, the Deco International Band will always be here to do you good. We're going to enjoy the very final song from Adina. And Anna Joy is joining me on stage so we can wrap it all up. But it's been an amazing journey today. It's been beautiful. It's been fantastic. I have enjoyed the show. Uh, Auntie, and I'm Adina, sure you have to. Looking beautiful. Okay, I was so watching you, you guys. Ah, you look at oh. us. We are slaying on the set. So we need to show our outfits. Adina, once again, you look amazing. Thank you. I was enjoying you. your... Oh, thank you so much. You, uh, you inspired me. I knew you come wearing African. African. So me too, I wore African <laughs> today. I, I was like listening that. to you. You did an amazing job. So I loved much. it. And you are getting a lot of, lots of yeah. messages on our social media mm -hmm. platforms. It's, it's, it's but all fun. good things must come to an end, Adina. True. We need to go. But remember, guys, next week we'll be here, same time, same place, with three amazing acts. You can Even, rest assured. Yes, Nana. It's going to get better next week. It is. Better. Mm -hmm. It can't get better than Nadina. Really, well, guys? Well, it can't yeah. get better. I it's going to be the same way that you enjoyed nah, today. It needs to be if you enjoyed it? today, it to then tune it. Adina says it needs, it to, needs be to be better. Yes. If you enjoyed today, then tune in to next week where we bring you three spectacular artists who will rock the Saturday Live set. Remember, my name is Nana Ajwasako Diemensa, and I was doing this with Nana Tufua. Get interactive with us on CTTVGH, Twitter. Facebook. Yeah. yeah. We'll be back same time next week. If you guys are ready, we're yes. ready. Adina is still here with us. Yes. And oh, of course, big shout out to the man like Kwame Fachi. Salute hey. you, see you. <laughs> yes. We'll see you same time next week. Yeah. Adina, rock the spot. Let's go. Hey, please come back. Please come back. This one, we are doing it together. Do you hear that? Thank you.